In this time of reflection, how do you treat the other? Is it with open arms? Even when you welcome the other, how do you treat them? Do you inadvertently shame them? Today's Mida is Boshet, which is defined as humiliation or shame. We find Boshet 31 times throughout the latter parts of our Hebrew Bible, the Nevi'im or prophets and Ketuvim or writings. For instance, we find it in Jeremiah, let us lie down in our shame, let our disgrace cover us, for we have sinned against the eternal our God. We and our ancestors from our youth to this day, and we have not heeded the eternal our God. This verse is especially helpful because it defines shame as negative attributes as it connects the Jewish people's actions to disgrace. Shame is a social justice issue, and throughout our history, we've seen the shaming of others. Maybe it's deliberately connecting immigrants to crime. Maybe it's ignoring the downtrodden on the streets or in the subway. Maybe it's microaggressions, the small or subtle actions of discrimination against a marginalized group or person. Maybe it's not using the correct pronoun. If it negatively affects the other person or group, even if it's unintentional, it's still creating bochette. We are not perfect. And maybe you feel some shame as you've realized you've inadvertently embarrassed someone else. That means you are human, as we all make mistakes. But what helps you become your best spiritual self is learning from that action that created the shame. As we prepare for the new year, may we all grow and remove a little bochette from our world.